here is a good view of the Soyuz TMA-13, which is now currently about 800 meters away from the International Space Station, beginning a process that will ultimately lead it uh, to a short fly around to align uh, its forward docking port precisely with the nadir or earthward-facing docking port of the Zarya module of the International Space Station. The view you're looking at is from an external camera on the uh, Soyuz vehicle as it uh, begins uh, its final approach uh, for a fly-around that will put it directly behind and in precise alignment with the Zarya module's docking port uh, at a distance of about 100 meters or so for some 10 minutes of station keeping to enable Russian flight controllers to assess the precise alignment of the forward docking port of the Soyuz uh, with that Zarya module docking port before uh, the automated sequence uh, will resume uh, the final approach of the Soyuz for link-up at about 3.33 a.m. Central Time, 12.33 p.m. Moscow Time today. The uh, Soyuz are now going through a rotational maneuver to, uh, to more precisely align uh, its forward uh, docking probe uh, with the uh, docking port of the Zarya module. Once uh, the two vehicles come into contact and capture one another with one another, there'll be an opportunity for the relative motion of the two vehicles to dampen out against each other, at which point uh, the uh, docking probe in the uh, Soyuz will begin uh, to pull uh, the uh, docking port of the Zarya module and the two docking uh, interfaces will come together. Uh, hooks and latches will then begin to engage to form a hard mate and a tight seal uh, will be uh, engaged between the two craft, setting the stage uh, for about an hour and a half worth of leak checks on both sides of the docking interface and the opening of the hatches between the two vehicles. External cameras on the International Space Station capturing an excellent view of the Soyuz TMA-13. Uh, that uh, flashing object, that is the uh, core's navigational antenna, the automated rendezvous antenna that is basically pulsing uh, a comparable system on the uh, Russian segment of the International Space Station to receive updated navigational data on its range uh, to docking and its rate of closure. As the Soyuz uh, navigates its way over the next 90 meters, you'll see a slight course correction that will ultimately put uh, the Zarya docking port that you see just to the right of the crosshairs in the middle of those crosshairs. This again all conducted uh, through an automated pre-programmed system. The core's navigational antenna should be retracting a short time from now on computer command. 33 meters now separating Soyuz, an excellent view of the uh, three-segment Soyuz vehicle, the docking probe on the right, the crew safely strapped into their seats in the center or descent module section of the Soyuz vehicle, and on the left side of your screen, the instrumentation and propulsion module. Well, decimal five meters range. Eight meters range. From truss cameras on the International Space Station, the final 17 meters separating Soyuz from Zarya. The two spacecraft, the International Space Station and Soyuz, passing high over southern Asia. See target clearly, crosshairs in place. Three meters, getting close, crosshairs in place. The target is moving somewhat to the right, downwards, the crosshairs. Ten meters away, flight controller standing by for contact and capture of the International Space Station. The target is back in the middle. In the middle, we have capture, we have indicated. Docking confirmed. Capture. Copy. The International Space Station now in free drift to prevent any inadvertent jet thruster firings. Docking occurring over Kazakhstan earlier than had been planned at 3.26 a.m. Central Time, 12.26 p.m. Moscow Time. So new residents have now arrived at the International Space Station. Mike Fink returning uh, 
to what was his home for six months, four years ago during Expedition 9, when he was the flight engineer along with his commander, Gennady Padalka. Think now the Expedition 18 commander arriving with Soyuz commander and flight engineer Yuri Lanchikov and U.S. space flight participant Richard Garriott, who will spend 10 days on the International Space Station. Now the opening of the hatch between the two crews, the hatch opening marked right on time at 4.55 a.m. Central Time, 1.55 p.m. Moscow time. You see Mike Fink uh, entering the International Space Station. Yuri Lanchikov as well, all three crew members now having joined their Expedition 17 counterparts. All six crew members now on board the International Space Station. And there you see Richard Garriott, the spaceflight participant, arriving on board the complex. The uh, crews will move back into the uh, Russian segment of the International Space Station to set up for congratulatory phone calls from the host of VIPs that are on hand here in Koryov, outside of Moscow. A good view of Mike Fink, uh, the new Expedition 18 commander aboard the International Space Station as he and his uh, colleagues uh, begin to, to discuss the setup uh, for their uh, remarks upon arrival. Good afternoon, Sergey. Good afternoon, Oleg. Good afternoon, Gregory and the new crew. Michael, Yuri, and uh, Richard. I would like to congratulate you on uh, your meeting in space. We're finished with the first stage of our joint operation. Good luck to all of you. And I see that uh, Oleg is due for a haircut. Thank you very much. Greetings. It's great to see you guys. You look great. Welcome to your new home. We wish you all the best and look forward to uh, seeing you uh, either at home in a few days or uh, in six months. So congratulations. Thank you very much. Guys, this is Alexander Alexandrovich Volkov. Congratulations <laughs> to all of you. Congratulations to the crew that just arrived on board the space station. We're glad to see all of you together after the new crew spent two days in the coldness and the crowdedness of uh, the Soyuz capsule. Congratulations on your meeting in space, and uh, I wish you all the best. Thank you, Alexander Alexandrovich. Thank you. First of all, congratulations on Titan's arrival on board the space station. We saw how well the old crew welcomed you aboard their home. I would like to wish you all the best in your uh, new endeavor, and uh, as uh, Vitaly Alexandrovich Lopotov said, this is uh, just the beginning. Thank you. This is Vasily Tsubliev. Congratulations to all of you. Good luck. And Michael, remember, study, study, and study. Yes, I remember. Thank you very much, Vasily Vasilievich. Michael, this is your wife, Renita. I'm here with your three beautiful children, Tundra, Carly, and Surya. We're very proud of you. We're proud of the entire crew, and we love you very much and hope you have a great mission. Tundra wants to say hi. Hi, Dad. Tundra wants to say hi. Hi, Dad. Hi, Tundra. I'm very happy to hear you, and I'm very happy to hear your mom. And I love you, and I love your sisters very, very much, and I love your mom so much. I'm glad to be here. Thanks for letting me come to the space station. I'm doing great. Hi, Daddy. Hi, 
Tara Lee, I love you. I love you from space. Hello, Michael. It's your father. Uh, we're so proud of you. There's your mother. Hi, Mike. It's Mom. Uh, Hi, Dad. The crew looks Hi, great. Mom. Everything looks great. Congratulations. Thanks. I'm up here with a handsome bunch of guys, that's for sure. And congratulations to all of the Titan crew. All three of the Titan crew, we saw your entry done well, and we're looking forward to 10 more days at Richard. And we want to, for uh, several of your other family members to at least say hello, Richard. Hi, Peter Pan. Ah, oh, very good. Thank you, Pops. <laughs> hey, thanks. I can fly. You can fly. Peter Pan is on a space station. Hey, Ricardo. Yeah, thanks. Uh, thank you. Love you back, and uh, I'm sure you're enjoying it so far. Hey, Ricardo, I uh, just wanted hey, to say you, we, got, we got your message, and congratulations on leaving the cradle of Earth. Ah, great. I'm glad you managed to uh, yeah, decipher it. I'll, I'll bet you have a little help there from our uh, friends back home. Thank you. Tanya, thank you very much. I have you loud and clear. Thank you. Say hi to all of my friends. I love you as well very much. Uh, please pass on my best regards to everyone. Yes, and all of your friends and all the family members are saying hello. Yuri. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you. My dear friends, I wish you the best of luck, a great job in the future, and strive to do your best. Thank you very much. Okay, and this is the end of our PAO event. All the best to all of you. Thank you.